Dustin Young 86 here, aka the Real World Champion on Instagram, here with another BCA Jax unboxing, uncarding, whatever you want to call it, video. If you get a chance, please like, subscribe, comment down below. I will get back to you. I do appreciate your support in getting through these videos. I know that they can be a little bit taxing on everyone to watch every single video. So I don't expect you guys to, but I appreciate you if you do. So today we have a figure that's pretty common, but I decided to get an MOC because I went out to get a lot from somebody for like 60 bucks for like 40 figures or something like that. And I got there and all the figures were beat to shit. I literally could take maybe seven of them. Uh, I went ahead and took, I think six, one of them being Cactus Jack and then the other being, there was a Dan Severn in there as well and I figured that was worth 20 bucks at least. So I went, ended up grabbing six figures. One of them I grabbed was Draws and I thought that he was in really good condition and then I noticed that his goatee had been ripped off. Uh, so I put mine back out there on the market and decided to pick another one up. Uh, that would be exactly what we are uncarding today. The Deadly Games Draws. Uh, this is actually the second release of Draws. The first release of Draws was in the, what was it, Fully Loaded? No, not Fully Loaded. It was the, what was the set? I know it had a King of the Ring card. Either way, it was another draws. He came with the puke and sink. It may have been fully loaded series two. I don't know. Either way, this is a draws. Instead of the puke and sink, this one comes with a tire, which uh, is good for your Mark Henry figures to flip. Or whenever you get Luke Cage, you can make him throw this like 40 feet in the air. Uh, either way, this is a draws figure that uh, I needed for my collection. I ended up getting him MOC for a fairly decent price. Uh, using the Mark Marrow body, obviously. Uh, but anyways, let's look at the back of the card. In this set, we have the Maximum Set uh, Sweat Series 1, The Undertaker, The Rock, who apparently came with a ladder, Kane with a crate of dynamite. Actually, this Kane's mask came off, and he basically looked like the fucking Undertaker. Stone Cold Steve Austin with the sledgehammer, stealing Triple H's gimmick again. Shawn Michaels with a fold-up chair. And Triple H with the trash can, you know, so he can put all the all the people he buries in the trash. Down here we have the Superstar Series 8, the Team Corporate. You've got the Big Boss Man, Kamish Michaels, Shane McMahon in a suit, The Rock in some uh, slacks, Ken Shamrock screaming for his life, and then Kane which was like released 40 million times. Then down below in the Too Tough Series 4, you've got The Rock versus Mankind, The Undertaker versus Kane. By the way, this was much darker gray when you bought it. And Kane's got both sleeves, so it might be The Undertaker under the mask. Uh, Bossman versus Austin. Uh, this Bossman actually came with a cool ass ski mask that was cloth. And then uh, Val Venus versus Billy Gunn. This is actually the Val Venus and Billy Gunn I picked up in a in a lot on eBay. And uh, Val actually had his towel, and this Billy Gunn is a great figure. It's a a black attire with a uh, silver wash over. It looks really nice. Then you've got the Camo Carnage Signer, which is uh, Camo Carnage series, which is a, a uh, offshoot of the Stomp series, except these were much bigger and a completely different body sculpt for everybody. You've got uh, Road Dog Jesse James, Badass Billy Gunn, Triple H, X-Pac, China, and Stone Cold Steve Austin. So basically DX in Austin. And then you've got the cool ass wrestling ring with all the DLC. Basically the game of the year edition with the cage and the two catapults. But the back of the card is not why you're here. Oh, oh he, this draws also includes a roadkill tire. That's the tire we spoke of. WWF 2000. Anyways, uh, let's get to why you're here. There's the Uncardi, there's the barcode. There goes the card. Bubble. The tire. He's a squishy. He's a squishy, 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 squishy. Hey, look, it's rolling away. 
Draws. As I stated earlier, Draws is using the Mark Marrow body. You can see he's got his tongue out, which is really cool about this figure is his tongue is a separate piece from the head. So if you take the head off, the tongue will come out and be a sec separate piece. So it is a completely separate piece from the body. I don't know if you can see that, but completely separate piece that connects inside the head. Uh, the part on mine that was missing was this little part right here on the bottom of the orange uh, rubber band. And so I decided to get this. And also on the other one, he had like some red Sharpie marks on his head. I'm guessing somebody tried to make their fingers bleed and it didn't work out the way they had planned because the blood did not come off. Anyways, uh, his leg is loose out of the box. Let's see, his waist works. The head doesn't turn. This is before they started using the hard plastic. No bone crunch in the arms. Oh, nope, not in the leg either. Obviously no neck. So this is the Road Rage, no, this is the Deadly Games Draws. Actually also in this set was the Oddities Kurgan who had no teammates. But Oddities Kurgan. So, uh, yeah, Draws. I mean, I have d over there if he starts to get sassy. Take care of him. Anyways, like, subscribe, comment for more. Uh, I really appreciate you guys watching these videos. I know they're long. I know they're tedious. I know you probably don't care about some of them, but I appreciate it. Uh, hit me up. Let's talk some wrestling. See you next time.